In this lesson, we will see how we can easily create a table in Power BI. We will create a table and display records. Let's see. So we can easily display data in tabular format with Power BI. So you can create a table and display records. You can also sort the table values only at selected columns. With that, remove a column from the table. Now let us see an example to create a table. We created a project Amit underscore Power BI. Now let me create a new page. Here I'll select and name it tables. Okay. Now we already loaded our data, our Excel workbook, and this was our data. Okay, these are our columns. Now let us create a table. Go to visualizations panel. Click table. It will get created here. You can resize it like this. Let's say I resized it. I'll just uh, minimize it. I'll just drag it. Okay, now this looks fine. You would be wondering from where the data would be visible. Okay, so the loaded data's columns are visible here. We will click the columns for which we want the data on our table. We will only select some columns. You can drag them here. I'll start with category. Okay, then uh, you can go for sum of profit. Second one, I am dragging it here under the columns. Then your uh, sum of quantity. Here it is. Okay, then your uh, sum of sales. Here it is. And it's visible here. The table is visible. You can also shuffle it. So let's say I just want sum of sales after the category here in the table. So I'll just drag it and here it is sum of sales. Then I want sum of quantity and the last would be profit obviously. And here is our table. Okay, you can uh, take it like this and drag like this. Okay, now you would be wondering how we can sort the table values. Okay, to sort it, select the arrow key. When you keep the mouse cursor here, the arrow key would be visible. Let's say I place it on sum of quantity. It got sorted in descending order. I'll do it again and it will get sorted under ascending order. Okay. Also, we can remove any column from the table. How? Click the cross sign. That's it. Which cross sign? Here it is. If you want to remove any of the columns now, you can just click cross here. That's it. Let's say you want to remove sum of sales. Just click the cross for the specific column that is sum of sales. So guys, we saw how we can easily create a table. In the next lesson, we will see how we can easily format the table because you can see the font is less. The color we can easily change and we can easily update the design later on. Thank you for watching the video.